Hello, my name is Kurt Jensen, and I'm a certified technical expert at Hank Greff Chevrolet in Davidson. The video you're about to view should give you a thorough explanation of how things work. I personally viewed it myself and found it to be very informative. Enjoy! Charging the Volt can minimize your use of fuel. Here are some helpful tips on properly charging the Volt battery. Begin by selecting the energy icon on the MyLink center stack. From the summary screen, select Charging to view your current charge settings. You can make adjustments as needed. The Volt's battery can be charged using the included 120 volt AC charge cord or a 240 volt charging unit. Be sure to determine the voltage and amperage of your charging location before you begin. To charge the Volt, the vehicle must be in park. Now, push on the rear edge of the charge port door to release the door. If equipped, a ring of green light will appear when the charge port door is opened and remain active during charging to show the charging status. Open the rear hatch and remove the charge cord from the storage compartment. Plug the charge cord into the electrical outlet. Check the charge cord status indicator light next to the lightning bolt icon. It should be a solid green. Now plug the connector into the charge port. You'll hear at least one audible tone and the indicator light on the dashboard will flash yellow and then green indicating the charging process has begun. While charging, the light will flash a certain number of times, letting you know the amount of charging that has been completed. When the charge cord is properly connected, it's equipped with a theft alert system. To arm it, lock the vehicle with the RKE transmitter. You can also insert a small padlock into the hole next to the charge release button to lock the coupler to the charge port. It's important to note that the charging system might run fans and pumps that result in sounds from the volt while it's turned off. Additional clicking sounds may be caused by the electrical devices used while charging. Don't worry. These are the sounds associated with an advanced electrical vehicle. To end the charge, unlock the vehicle with the RKE transmitter. This will disarm the charge cord theft alert. Unplug the charge cord connector from the vehicle and close the charge port door by pressing firmly on the rearward edge of the door surface. Unplug the charge cord from the electrical outlet and return the charge cord to the storage compartment. The Volt takes approximately 19 hours to charge using the 120 volt AC electrical outlet with the default 8 amp AC current setting. When using the 12 amp AC current setting, the Volt charges in about 13 hours. When using a 240 volt charging station, it will take approximately four and a half hours to charge the vehicle. Charging will vary with outside temperature. You can contact a Bosch representative at www.pluginnow.com for more information about Volt's 240 volt charger options and where to find 240 volt charging locations in your city and across the U.S. and Canada. I hope that video presentation is a confident on how to operate your personal car technology. If you have any questions, please contact me by phone email, or at my website, www.graphguru.com. Thanks again for watching, and have a great day.